And then fresh by Ian McIntosh. When I look back to Lost and Found and Under the Influence and Recession, we had basically started the TGR Pemberton Sled Show. We didn't really have a huge idea of what was out there and, and it was kind of a cool time for us because basically we didn't have to go far at all to find stuff that to us was completely new and different. Dana and I truly believe the Pemberton area is basically like mini AK. It's a perfect spot to train for Alaska. And for us, it was just like the ultimate dream, you know? Every day you wake up and go out in your backyard and, and hit new stuff. I definitely feel like I grew within that space and learned a lot about what it takes to, you know, get out there and find new terrain and, and how to decipher a topo map and be able to be like, okay, we're gonna be able to get in here with our snowmobiles and, and this potentially has the opportunity to be an awesome zone. Those early days of sledding in the Pemberton and Whistler area were very much planting that seed of like, I wanna be an exploratory big mountain skier. As we're exploring and trying to find new stuff throughout the winter in Pemberton and every spring I keep going to Alaska and we're kind of getting little tidbits of finding new faces that haven't been ridden. That really like started to become the most important thing to me and, and a great inspiration. In those years I was really still following and and looking to the people that were way more experienced than me and that had a lot more knowledge in that environment like Jeremy or Sage or Seth you know I was taking a lot from those people and so at the, at the time you know I was still learning a lot and really starting to get more and more comfortable in that environment, but at the same time, wanting more. Those next couple years that we had in Haines really got that taste of what getting AK good is really like. You know, one this one day in particular, I remember it was just like over the head barreling deep and we were at this face we call abandonment, which was a face that I was first introduced to my very first year. And here we are, you know, several years later, hitting those lines again. Even though it was an awesome experience and truly amazing and the snow was unbelievable, it was like, this isn't what Alaska is to us. Alaska is to us what, what it was for TGR back in the earliest days when everything was a new experience. When they discovered Haines, it was like this vast world no one had ridden before and, and we wanted that experience. That's definitely like fueled that whole like exploration vibe, which I guess ultimately led to where we have been in the last few years in Alaska.